Hello little legends! This September, we're going to learn about God's faithfulness. Are you guys ready? Okay, let's begin! Time passed and Moses grew up. He did not like the way the Pharaoh treated his fellow Israelites. So he left Egypt, but God's people were still slaves under Pharaoh. They prayed to God for someone to help them. Moses did not know it, but God planned to use him to help the enslaved Israelites. He ended up in a place called Midian and married a woman named Zephora. As more years went by, the old Pharaoh died and his son took his place. But the Hebrews were still slaves and they prayed to God for help. God heard their prayers. He felt bad for them. He knew just what he was going to do next. After all, God had this plan all along. After many years living outside of Egypt, one day Moses noticed a burning bush. Moses approached it and God called out to him from the bush. God told him, take off your shoes because where you are standing is holy ground. I am going to send you back to Pharaoh and bring my people out of Egypt. But Moses was afraid to go. Then God showed Moses his great power. He turned his staff into a serpent. Moses packed his things and family and went back to Egypt. Bravely, Moses and his brother Aaron went to Pharaoh and said, Let my people go. But the new Pharaoh, the brother he grew up with, said he would not obey Moses' God. God would have to use his great power to change Pharaoh's mind. Pharaoh was angry. God commanded him through Moses to let his people go. But Pharaoh refused. So God sent a number of plagues to Egypt. God sent frogs, lice, boils, locusts, and three days of darkness, but he still refused to let them free. God sent one more plague. After that plague, Pharaoh finally agreed to let the Israelites go. As quickly as they could, God's people marched out of Egypt. After 430 years, they were finally free. The Israelites did not pack enough food, so God provided for them with manna and quail from heaven. God always protected his people, day and night, forever. Our power verse for today is 2 Thessalonians 3 verse 3. The Lord is faithful. He will give you strength and protect you. Little legends, little legends, it's time that we start. We've got a Bible story for you and really cool art. Little legends, little legends, you've got special plans. So open up the Bible and you'll understand.